Star Wars came out today. You think I want to be out there in the cold? Freezing my ass off? Doing organized complaining like some sort of wavy gravy hippie from Vermont? That's not what I wanted to be doing at all. But I received some advice from my mentor at Grover Beach, Mayor John Scholes, that I needed to participate in some civil disobedience. He says to me, Ty, protesting, that's a fantastic passive-aggressive way for you to push your political agenda on the public without disturbing Johnny Law. So I says, how, Grover Beach Mayor John Scholes? How do I do that? He says to me, first, you're going to want to go to Whole Foods and round up some hippies, a couple dozen of them. They just sit there in front of Whole Foods like day laborers waiting for something to protest. I says to him, we don't got a Whole Foods. He says to me, really? I says to him, really? He says to me, really? You don't got a Whole Foods? I says to him, really? We don't got a Whole Foods. We got a Trader Joe's. Will that work? He says to me, probably not. Hi, I'm 2018 Paso Robles, California mayoral candidate, Awesome Ty Biz Cosney. Uh, today's objective is to recruit an army, if not a legion, of filthy, peace-loving hippies to join my civil protest downtown. Now, I've received some advice that they often patronize this Trader Joe's market in absence of a Whole Foods in our city. So we're going to head inside, see if we can round up some hippies, get them to come join in the, the protesting or whatever it is we're going to do today. Let's get to work. You'd think there'd be more VW bugs and buses instead of these BMWs. I don't know what's up with that. Lexus. Huh, maybe I've been misled about hippies. Hi, I'm 2018 Paso Robles, California, mayoral candidate Austin Ty Biscossi. I just wanted to let you know that we're holding a civil protest down in front of City Hall today. Uh, if you're not busy for the next eight to 10 hours, we'd love to have you come down. Protest whatever you want. It's a non-specific protest. You know, it's just basically getting your grievances out, letting City Hall know that you know you've had enough of whatever it is is bothering. You. Which City Hall is this? Uh, Paso Robles. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. I wish I had one of those bells. Hi. Hi, I'm 2018 Pastor Robles, California Mayor of Canada, and Austin Bible Scott. I just wanted to let you oh. Hi. I just wanted to let you folks know that we're holding a civil protest of the liberals down in front of City Hall today. Uh, if you're not busy for the next eight to ten hours, we'd love to have you come down. And I have a megaphone. It's not really working. Uh, I guess we can head inside see if there's some hippies in there. What's that smell? Is that is that patchouli? I smell the patchouli, but I don't see the hippies. It's, it's not adding up. What even is this? Brussels sprouts. Just, that's how they come grow in water before they were uh, we're holding a civil yeah, protest in front of City Hall today uh, for the next 8 to 10 hours. If you have anything, you know, any guys, we can't you want to get out. I can't do that. Can we do that in here?
So while trying to round up and recruit hippies for our civil protest downtown, we were escorted out of this Trader Joe's. You know, I was polite to them, I offered them a button, did nothing. It's the kind of shabby treatment I would expect from maybe a Whole Foods, but not Trader Joe's. So I guess I'm just a one-man protest. Couldn't find any hippies, just yuppies. So we went to the Trader Joe's, but I didn't see any hippies. Not inside, not out. Saw some hipsters, saw some yuppies, not any hippies. Probably would have been a little easier if I would have pulled my gun out, but then that's kidnapping and not a civil protest at all. Luckily for us, I put my mind to work and came up with a way for me to do the job of a hundred hippies, just one man. The patented, uh, awesome tie, um, protesting sign, 3,000. Uh, it's an interchangeable sign, as you can see, where you can support a wide variety of issues. You see a Republican walking by, support your conservatives, Yeehaw! You see a liberal walking by, Hey, what's up, cousin? Or, or whatever it is, a liberal. Feminism, you see a woman walking by. Support feminism. Equal rights for the women. Get them out the kitchen. You see a millennial walking by. Memes, memes. You know, like the, the, the Pepe frog and all that bullshit. Support these hippies. Support these hippies. Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? These hippies. Support the draft. Go serve your country in Vietnam. It's a fantastic idea. So we took it down to City Hall and put it to work. Hey, no, hey, no, 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 no. no. Well, despite the lack of hippies, we're here at City Hall and I've got everything I need to participate in civil disobedience. I've got my signs, my interchangeable signs, supporting a wide variety of causes and protesting others. And I've got this megaphone, so I can project my voice. Let's get to work. Ban flat earth net jobs! They're crazy! They make no sense! It's been scientifically disproven already! Stop these senseless ninja attacks! They've gone on for far too long and I cannot fend them all off on my own! Support disgrace politicians! This is America! Everybody needs a second chance! Keep Emilio Estevez out of our films! Out of our films! Out of our films! Support my campaign for mayor! Ideally monetarily! Via PayPal! Two, four, six, eight! Who do we really hate? Open mouth chewers! Support the troops! United States Army, U.S. Marines, the Navy, community services, the Paso Robles who just pulled up. You gotta get rid of them. I mean, what have they ever done for anybody? Who needs them, right? Come up with a new term. He's creepy and I don't particularly care for his work. It might just get you that promotion you've been eyeing, sweetie. Where's the town charter, Steve Martin? It really is fantastic chicken. He said he's not a crook, but more do you want? It's not the same one you commonly think of when you hear the name Steve Martin. If I had my pistol right now, I'd show all of you. Your days are numbered. Never forget. S support net neutrality. I think. Ban net neutrality. Or is it support net neutrality? Who won the election? Yeah. Betty. What's that? Who won the oh, election? Should we ban Trump? Hey, good for you. Thank you. Would you like a button? Sure, why not? Awesome TV. Oh, awesome tie. Oh, awesome tie. 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 Protesting sign 3000 was wildly ineffective. Uh, aside from one elderly incoherent gentleman who took great interest in our protest, nobody stopped. Nobody joined in to participate. Our message was not heard. Look, I'm not going to sit here and insinuate that the lack of foot traffic in front of City Hall where we were protesting was due to not that Steve Martin setting off some sort of false fire alarm before we arrived and getting everybody out of the building. But I also can't disprove it. Protesting's a bunch of bullshit. Didn't really help us at all. So we're going to take matters to the extreme. Hi, I'm 2018 Paso Robles, California mayoral candidate Awesome Ty Vizcosti. When I'm not starring in my hit YouTube series, Awesome Ty is running for mayor, 
for running for mayor. I'm down here at this general store, purchasing, I don't know, I guess like parts for my wagon. When you're about to pack up and head down the Oregon Trail, you don't want to die of dysentery. You want to make sure you stock up with everything that you may need, from ammunition for your rifle, to a 100 pound bag of grain, to live oxen. Anything you need, this general store has you covered. When you stop in, be sure to tell them that Awesome Ty sent you, because otherwise I don't know how I'm going to get paid. I mean seriously, I don't think they know I'm doing this. Hi, I'm 2018 Paso Robles, California mayoral candidate Awesome Ty Biz Costney. Uh, in a defiant show of civil disobedience against the man, I've went ahead and I've chained myself to this massive oak tree. The only problem right now is that I hadn't really thought past chaining myself to this tree. To be honest with you, I'm not really sure what we're protesting, what we're supposed to be mad at. All I know is that protesting in front of City Hall with signs sure didn't work. And we were unable to find any hippies. So this is more or less a last resort type deal. No food until the liberals are gone! No food until the liberals are gone! Remove the conservatives from office, please! I will remain chained to this oak tree until they are gone. No more Fast and Furious movies! None was more than enough! Restore the legacy of Christopher Columbus at once! No food until he's cherished! I'm 2018 Paso Robles, California mayoral candidate Awesome Ty Costney. I have chained myself to this large oak tree in civil protest. Go about your business, do not be alarmed. Not that Steve Martin, not that Steve Martin, not that Steve Martin, not that Steve Martin. No, I don't want any change. No, no, I'm, I'm chained to this tree as a pro... It's a protest. Just threw a quarter at me. I'm chained to this tree in protest of injustices worldwide. Have a nice day. Hi, sir. Sir. Madam. Anybody? So this isn't working whatsoever. People are just walking right by me, not paying me any attention. And I'm pretty sure a bird just shat on me. Another great idea, campaign manager. Man, this isn't really working. Uh, just want to go ahead and go? I left my water in the car. Uh, yeah. Bird. You got the key? Yeah. Uh, Bird shit everywhere. God damn it! Wait, do you have the key? I know! Uh, why would I have the key? I thought I gave you the key. Where's the key? I don't have it in my pipe. Fucking kidding me, man? Hold on, I got it. I got this. Excuse me, do you have any bolt cutters? Do you have bolt cutters? All right, thank you. Excuse me, do you have any bolt cutters? No? Bolt cutters? <sighs> Sir, do you have any bolt cutters? We've, we've misplaced the key. This was a terrible idea! Do you have any bolt cutters? Do you have any bolt cutters? Please? Hi, I'm 2018 Pastor Robles, California mayoral candidate Austin Ty Ms. Costney. You might be saying to yourself, why is this attractive young man chained to a tree downtown the park? You'd be intrigued to know that I'm actually running for office. And Pastor Robles here next November, and I sure appreciate your sure appreciate your vote. Oh, I can't run. I can't run like this, ma'am. No. Bolt cutters, I need, does anybody have any bolt cutters? What are you doing? Oh, I'm chaining myself to this tree. Okay. To, to protest the variety of things or, or support other things, really. I mean, the causes are just mostly interchangeable. All right. I'm running for mayor next November. So oh, you are? Okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. And you know, civil protest, civil disobedience seems to be the hot button trend right now, so I figured I'd participate, you know what I mean? <laughs> there you go. Well, good luck. Yeah. Oh, I also lost the key. So if you have a pair of bolt cutters, that would really come in handy right now. My friend is chained to a tree. I need bolt cutters. My friend is stuck on a tree. One day, one day, I'm gonna get unchained. 
You find bolt cutters? No bolt cutters. No key. No bolt this cutters. This is fucking fantastic, Nobody man. Has. Terrific work, again, as usual. I don't is, know what. Is, like, is that the key right there? It's the key right there. In the lock. You found it. You put it in there? I'm free. I'm free from my chain. I don't know what sitcom you got that idea from, but sure didn't work, did it? There I am, just chained to this tree, helpless, like some asshole deadhead. Crying out for help. Starving. Not a single person stops to help me. Nobody lends a helping hand. Nobody offers bolt cutters or to alert the fire department. Nobody cares. That's the community that we presently live in under the Not That Steve Martin administration. And that's one thing that I promise I will change. If I see somebody chained to a tree, protesting, starving, I'm going to go over and offer them a helping hand. Protesting doesn't work at all. It's a bunch of bullshit. Just look like a whiny asshole out there. Doing is the best way of saying. Now, if you'll excuse me, it's time for me to go spread some Christmas cheer.